Okay, let's get it together. First, we gotta turn this off again. Find it to turn it off. It's in the bag. It's in the bag. It's in the bag. It's in the bag. Oh, and then we've got to find a lucky stick or incense, as you would know it. And we gotta light the. What happened? I had it longer. One, two, three, four. They must have lit that burn, or somebody must have used it. Oh, okay. Somebody else using the. At least they understand what the lucky stick is. Let's light it up. Why? Because we have to clear the air. Well, I don't know. It's, clear the air is just an expression. But what I'm doing is uh, creating smoke. Nice. No, yeah. This is like a very old uh, stick that I found. So I'm just trying to get rid of it. It's a big one. It's citronella. And it's very old. We're just laying on there, you know. So let's figure it out. Use it. Yeah, there you go. Now you, now you're getting it. Uh. Okay, it's just in case you don't know what this is. This is a. Uh, this is uh, behind the scenes as I make an Instagram. And, uh, uh, yes, we're making an Instagram. And did I tell you? Well, of course I didn't tell you. I mean, did I tell you? It's a rhetorical kind of thing. But uh, I was with my sister yesterday. We was, we, she has this thing about going to the Commodore Theater. It's, it's a theater that you have meals and it's like a supper club, whatever. You have, you can eat in the theater. There's tables and there's a phone and you, you, you pick it up and you dial the thing, get to your menu, whatever have you. It has cute little lights or whatever have you. Okay. So every time I'm here, that's her thing. She likes, she loves going to the Commodore Theater. Now it has a history that there's a lot of locals don't go because they think it's, you know, because back in the day it was racism and, you know, that our discrimination and that are, and then they refuse to go to the Okay, well, whatever. It costs, oh, senior says it costs $6, but here's, check this out. So, actually, we was going, we was, uh, it was, Black Adam was playing a couple of weeks ago. We figured it was still playing, so we was going to see Black Adam at the Commodore. Okay, so, you know, I, I leave it for my sister to check the schedule and stuff like that. But, as it were, Black Adam left on Wednesday. This was Thursday, but it was going to the Commodore. So back out, I'm left, and this other this smile, this horror film. I, like, ah, I wasn't into that. So we ended up, but I did want to see Black Adam, and she sort of, well, she didn't really. She goes to the Commodore Theater. That's her thing, going to the Commodore Theater, you know, blah, 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 blah. But, uh, but I said, oh, I want to see it. And so the time difference, like I said, ah, let's just take, let's just go from, because we was down to Commodore already, realizing that, oh, no Black Adam, you know. And so we went, and uh just went to Chesapeake Square and to the to the XP or whatever the big the thing with the, with the good sound system. See Black Adam, right? Mistake. Black Adam. I don't know what I don't know what people are saying about Black Adam, but nada. No. No. Sorry. Sorry, Dwayne the Rock Johnson. You know, a lot of stuff, but no substance. You know, and maybe it's just a comic book thing. So I got some coconut water. And I got aloe, aloe juice, so I got some coke. <gasps> I got to tell you, I just, uh, I'll get back to the Black Adam. No, I'm not going to get back to Black Adam. Black Adam is gone. Boom. Done. <laughs> I ain't got to wait. No, don't waste no breath on it. I'm not wasting any breath on it. You shouldn't waste anything on it either. I shouldn't say that. Do what you want, you know. Mm. I still have some aloe vera juice in here. Let me drink it all because I love this coconut water. You mean you love it so? Yeah, this is coconut water, 100% to a nature's nectar, 100% pure coconut water, uh, uh, tropical hydration. I guess that's a marketing scheme. Well, here's the thing about this. This is my favorite coconut water. I shouldn't say it like that, but I've tasted coconut water for a bunch of a bunch of hundred percent contains hundred percent juices. Really, I should say contains hundred percent water. Uh, but this comes from. Ingredients, coconut water contains tree nut, tree nuts, coconut. Distilled exclusively by Avon something, Batala, Illinois, I guess. Product of Vietnam. 
I've tasted a lot of coconut waters. Tasted coconut water from Brazil. Now, I mean, not in, in Brazil, I had coconut. You get water from water. You know, in India, you get the you know from from the water, including sugar that sugar cane stuff. That sugar cane juice is really good. Um, you know, these places. You know, uh, uh, Laos. You know, you get the coconut from the yeah, whatever. Um, but then, when I started to get these coconut water, these packaged ones, you know. Like that, I look where it's from, right? And there's a lot come from Thailand. Thailand's, uh, Thailand, Thailand's good, right? That's some Brazil. Brazil is good. Um, what uh, Puerto Rico, good, like that. Philippines. Oh, not in my cup. Wait a second, drink my coconut water. Do not like the coconuts from Philippines. I don't know what they do. Maybe they, I guess they go through Australia, but some whatever their processing is, it's like, ah, I'm not with it. But Vietnam, I discovered that, where was I to Vietnam? Was that, not? In, I wasn't in Vietnam. Uh, uh, even when I was in the service, I stayed in the States. I, I never left the States. So, I, you know, I knew how the war was going because I was supplying blood to them. But, you know, I mean, I was in the... Don't, don't worry about it. It's that Mac Command, Mac Wire for a space, a long story. Um, but I must have been... Maybe it was South Africa. Or maybe it was... South, I think it was South Africa. I discovered the Vietnam coconut water. But the only place that carries this here in the States that I... I shouldn't say that, that. That I've come across is this called Aldi, A-L-D-I. One of the guys... One of the guys... Trader Joe's brother. Or something. One of those guys. You know, one of them died. Peace and blessings on his soul. But... Um, but they have, they have, because, you know, I guess these supermarkets get, get, get deals, whatever it is. And, you know, like, like um, who is it? Uh, not Food Line. Um, what's the other one? Uh, Kroger's and Harris Teeters is hooked up. So they get the same kind of brand. My favorite is uh, the C, C, C2O Coconut Water, but no, not my favorite. That's, I, I like that one. But this Vietnam one. I really like. Now I did a whole thing on, on coconut water. Sorry about that. Mm. It started by me saying that to my sister with, uh, what's the name? Okay, now I'm getting, I got to get it together. Because uh, uh, officially, I mean, I'm, I've been told waxing on, waning, whatever have you, getting rid of people, whatever have you, you know, not listening. Uh, because this is the making of my Instagram that I do every day. Yeah, every day. I guess I do Instagram every day. So this is a making of when I, when can I, when I can do it. Oh, and oh, ah, of course. This is I walk with this. What did I listen to this morning? Uh, I'm not gonna tell you what I listened to this morning. But it's regular stuff. Um, I start with Nina and then go to Marvin and then to Valerie Simpson and then uh, whether did Prince or whatever. Somebody, um, uh, Greg, Greg Porter. But I gotta take off the airplane mode. Because take off the Bluetooth too. Because the airplane mode is what Mike Sergeant shared a real okay. Uh, but you know what we do? The first thing we do is we check how much. Don't you just love this feature? It's a feature. I, know, I guess it's a feature. Um, uh, how much I walk today? Fourteen thousand seven hundred ninety-seven steps. That would be nine point. Nine one kilometers, um, and that's uh, what was that? Add up to seven, fourteen, eighteen, nineteen, and nine. Oh, twenty-seven. That's a nine. It's good. Uh, nine point nine. Nine nine is eighteen. Eighteen and one is nine. That's uh, eighteen, nineteen, one, like that. But now we change the kilometers. Or kilometers. I don't know what that is. It's, it's spelled kilometers, but I think that's to say kilometers. I don't know. We we grew up in the states, so we do we don't you know whatever. So now I go nine point. Remember that number nine point one nine point nine one. Let's transpose like that. Then I go to the thing and I put in uh, nine. I guess you don't have to remember it because I'm putting it in now. Uh, 9.91. Is that what it was? 9.91 uh, kilometers. Uh, K I L O M E T E R. Kilometers equals E Q 
u equals a equals uh, miles equals miles there it is so I uh, want uh, six point one five seven seven eight nine miles uh, what's that uh, well, well six, six miles <laughs> We'll round it up, bottom round it up. Uh, nine, uh, this is, this, uh, so, so, uh, that's 14, uh, 15, 20, uh, then 29, uh, 30, that would be 37, and 6 would be 37, that's f well, 43. Well, it's a good number. Okay, I do my numbers, don't, don't, don't worry about that part. Okay, so that's what. Now you updated with that, and uh, so I was. Um, that's a little dust, whatever it is. Okay, we're almost ready. Wait a second. Okay. Ah, finish this whole thing. Some more. I'll leave it like that. Okay, am I ready? Am I ready? Are we? Oh. Because for the glasses, here we go. Because you know, what people don't understand when people do these Instagrams, it's all everybody's acting. I shouldn't say acting, but you know, what we do is well, what we do is what we do. So, can we just back just a little bit? Just a little bit. Boom. Just a little bit. Okay, here we go. Oh, Instagram. First, let me get to the Instagram. Uh, Oh, there's a what's the name? The cabby, cabby vix, cabby though. Well, we'll get to that some other time. I'm trying to get to his show sometime. Uh, live, Instagram, almost live. Ready? Almost. Okay. Gotta look good for the gram. Uh, there it is. Oh, hey, hey, Instagram is me, T from the Pattersons, taking a train to Tibet. Took about Tibet. Well, I didn't get these from Tibet, so I took a trip. But anyway, this comes from. Uh, was gifted to me, or gift made for me. There were seven of them made. I, I've retained two of them. Some people in the corner planet have it. I know that uh, Doza in uh, Philippi has has one. But gave it to me. Whatever. I don't know where. I've lost count. I don't know where the other ones are. But see, these are mangrove seed pods. Mangrove seed pods. Some place they call love beads. Just thought I'd tell you about that. So, so brother, why are you bringing this up? I'm gonna tell you why I'm bringing this up. I'll get back to it, but first I give you a, give you a preamble. So I went to see Black Adam last night. Don't ask. Well, anyway, I, I went to regular theater with an XP, whatever, and gets the sound. I got to go with good sound, right? And it's like, eh, eh, I'm not impressed. I, I know I grew up a Marvel kitty, but uh, DC was all right, but eh, I'm not impressed. <laughs> I wasn't impressed at all. You know, um, but here's the thing. Uh, the here's what I'm thinking, right? Uh, let me jump. I'm gonna, just going to be jumping back and forth so you understand. Uh, Pat McAfee, um, he has a show. It's a, a sports thing. People not into football, you don't know what I'm talking about. Anyway, he had a show, an NFL, right? They said they he couldn't use their logo. So <laughs> there's certain people you don't mess with, right? Pat McAfee is one of the people. So his whole crew, because the, the, the show is like basically you're, you, it's up, they give you insights into football like you're in the locker room. That's why I really like it. Right? I'm not a football person. Not anymore. I mean, well, I'm a Giants fan because my first job is working Yankee Stadium when the Giants were playing there. But I won't get into that. But anyway, um, so I like John, the, the McAfee show because uh, they, they have the toxic table. These two guys. Hilarious, right? Another guy, I, I guess he's a, I don't know what kind of fan he is. He wears the cowboy hat, but he has the Pittsburgh Steeler thing on in there. Then he had the back room. We got three fellas in the back, back room. 
uh, uh, then you have uh, then you have Pat McAfee. Then you have these guest people like uh, uh, Darius uh, 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 Darius uh, I call him D, but D Darius Butler uh, is one of the people he's on regularly two or three times a week. Uh, oh, I forgot AJ Hawk. He's on like every day, and he, he has to do do the, he has to he has to do the show from the from the studio. Uh, they call it the Thunderdome. Uh, and uh, 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 when he has to come in to do that because Pat McAfee does a Saturday thing for college football or whatever it is like that and then you have these other these two coaches that uh, that, that come in uh, 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 one, once a week and they one is hilarious or, you know what he said you, you're in the locker room you know they, 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 he's talking about usually the Thursday night game you know what the, what, the, what the coach would be saying what the head coach would be saying to the to the one team, then he goes and say to the other team, it's great. It's a great format. Okay. And then this other, um, uh, uh, I guess he's an offensive guy because, because Darius Butler does, uh, uh, he does the, um, uh, mainly defense, I guess, defense, because he was a defensive player. You know, uh, don't worry about it. You tune in if you can. Anyway, and then you have um, also, uh, let me not forget, um, oh, uh, what's his name? Uh, you know, the, the, not Tom Brady, the other guy, uh, Rogers. <laughs> Aaron Rogers comes in every Tuesday. He has his book club happening, whatever happened. Who am I waving at? Like that. Hey, whoever. Sp 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 Tom, hey, join. Hey, hey, Tom. Um, and then you also have uh, 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 um, uh, Von, uh, Von Miller. He, Von, Von's last name, Miller? He's, he comes in now on Thursdays, too. So it's a great little thing, but it's, it's a male thing. Which is what I like. I'm sorry, yo. I talk to men, okay? Football, men. Sorry, you know, y'all say what you want, whatever. That's what it is, okay? But the NFL cut away, so he went. They went off. They start calling the U.S. football, whatever, some strange name, and they got so much. The NFL got so much flack, right? That they had to just back away as oh, and then even even <laughs> even when back back away, when he's explaining how it all went down, that's even funny. Okay, anyway, so so I, I like I like that program. I, I, I sometimes I do watch the whole thing. Most of the time I just get little sections, but uh, whatever it is, right? But here's the thing: the reason why I bring up that whole thing about the internet because the internet smoke spoke smoke. Sorry. Um, because here's what happened: the, he, they got the NFL and people got so much flack from that. That whoa, they had to just immediately. I think it even hit Sports Illustrated. There was some article written on it. It's like whoa. So I guess the commissioner <laughs> went to all the commissioner said, "What the hell's going on?" Right. So anyway, so they got it straight. So they can use it. They can say the NFL before they couldn't say the NFL show any jerseys. It was, it was strange. even even there was a, a even a, like guests for they have interview football player. He said, look, I didn't want to get you in any trouble, so I, I, I hid my, I forgot what team it was on, I hid my thing so you wouldn't get in trouble. It was hilarious. It was, the hilarity was like, I guess it may have been less than a week, less and less than a week. But here's the thing, whoever made that decision at NFL, NFL Films, whoever, whoever made that decision, right? That's the thing is, these folks are out, they don't know what the internet is. All right, all these people want to send to the internet. They want to do this and that, that, that. They don't know what the internet is. They have no idea, and it's the internet, right? Everybody think they're going to do YouTube or or they go to big boy YouTube or Facebook or the banning of uh, Twitter. I'm not on Twitter. I'm just on Instagram and, and 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 YouTube, and I do YouTube for reasons. Okay, well, for me, it's archival purposes only. So I, even my thing, I don't monetize, and it's also. Um, uh, I don't ask for subscription. I don't ask for likes. Nothing like that. I don't monetize. It's Creative Commons. So, you know, you can use, you have to attribute if you use any stuff that you hear me wax and wane about. Or one of my interviews, you know, you've got to, you know, nobody gets paid. Okay. But the whole thing is some people use stuff in Instagram, like the Joff, Joff the Comedian, you know. Uh, he always used Instagram to, sh to promote his show that's going on. But then he shows some other stuff, you know, some, you know, some black content, whatever have you. But it, it, and a lot of people use the internet, like, like, like say, Jimmy Dore, you know, for, does his political thing. I love Jimmy Dore, sorry. It's just, you know, I like weird, weird people. And then, and, and they make money off of it because that's how they, they can continue, continue their thing, right? And he also advertises comedy shows, you know, that kind of thing. I listen to 5150 because I want to stay in touch with the, with 
that kind of with my people's, you know, with the downtrodden. They, they speak to the downtrodden like that. OK, so I give all this stuff up. To say, and even people like, OK, say, COVID, well, I mean, this is the COVID, um, the, um, COVID report. This is guy, uh, James Colbert out of Japan. And he does these. Uh, he, he give you stuff like he dig deep. He did. He, um, the reason I got into him is because I used to get a um, in the I guess it was the early 80s. I used to get a, a, a publication called uh, Covert Action Information Bulletin. It's like XCIA people, you know, and they put out the stuff. But they always give um, they give you the sources. You know, what I mean, they, they give you footnotes or whatever have you. So if, if an article they wrote and you said, oh, this sounds conspiracy, whatever, you look up the footnotes, do your own research. Well, this is what they do uh, uh, at James Colbert and also his uh, media monarchy, um, James Evan Pilato. Uh, they, they have this thing every Thursday. Uh, anyway, they, they they give you they, they and they give you the, the tribute to, you know, how you can research for yourself. Right. Now, a lot of these is these so-called. Like I like to say, lame street media. A hey, shout out to the woman in Alaska that started that whole thing. But you know, the major, the corporate media, they don't give you footnotes. They just we we, we present this. To, I'm sorry, we we like we we the authorities. We're gonna tell you something. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, but the point is, somebody in the NFL films thought that they would say, oh, they 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 you know, they're infringing upon our thing. They're stealing our stuff. They can't be saying that. They don't understand. It's nothing but the whole. Everything is advertisement. You know, even if you get, I like, say, bad advertising, but the more you can say that name, NFL, NFL, everybody said, oh, NFL, NFL, they're not. You see what I'm saying? But the people that, they, I guess they're getting some corporate corporate job and they want to put their fingerprint on it. Hey, look what I did. Oh, he, oh, ha, ha. I got some power. You know, stupid. Anyway, but a lot of us don't even deal with the political stuff. Well, not a lot of us. I deal with political stuff all the time. I think it's, I just think I'm having a ball listening to this, listen to idiots talk, you know. <laughs> <laughs> useful idiots and otherwise right um so and then a lot of things start like um that guy um uh andrew schultz you know he had said something on the internet and next you have to know without researching these policies without researching think policies stop repeating this stuff they don't even do if you're a politician don't you have a staff aren't you supposed to vet whatever since when you say vet whatever aren't you supposed to do stuff like that but no they just repeat what they hear on the internet without any stupid right but here's how I use the internet. Let me show you what I mean. And I mentioned these these things. This comes from India, right? Um, uh, Tamanadu, some 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 Tamanaduians, <laughs> Tamil, some Tamils. Right? It's, it's called Tamils. Yeah. Tamils. They look like basically they look like me, you know. Well, if I shave, if I shave and I put on a, 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 a shirt with a pocket and I put on a longi and I ride a Tamil bike, they start yabbing to me in Tamil because I think I'm from Tam, from from there. You know, I mean, a lot of places I go. If I look like, if I put on the attire of the people, I was in Armand Jordan one time. Put on the, you know, the headdress. I'm walking around. They, they Arab. Yeah, they throw them, you know, whatever. So I have that ability. And if you travel a lot, you need that ability, you know, because people accept you for who you are, not whatever it is. But I wear this a lot. Now, when I first started wearing this, oh, I'm sorry, I got it because uh, there's a there was a musical group there. I guess they still are there. I've got to get back to India. I don't want to get back next year. Uh, 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 the Schwerin Musical Group. Anyway, they, they make instruments, right? And I helped them out doing a, a little project. They was doing some drumming, and I helped them out a little project. It was just, just a little, um, what do you say, uh, um, uh, a little skit to help them produce. Whatever, it, I helped them out. Then the next year, I came back, and you know, I, I hung out with them for a while. They make these beautiful, beautiful instruments. You know, that's just beautiful instruments. And uh, so I said, hey, you know, when I was dancing in New York, I don't mean dance, I mean, you know, I was in New York. I, I wore these things. On my, on my, not these, but some ankle braces. Like, can you make me some? So, hey, sure, brother Anthony, anything for you. <laughs> so, so, they made these things, and it's really very well crept. They got this nice buckle like that, and this is like cowhide, right? And they, they glue it at that, that, and then even ones in, individually them, and I wear them. Now, when I started to wear them, people said, why do you wear that, right? And my, my first instinct was to, because I got a crack to myself, I said, you know, I'm walking two o'clock in the morning. I'm walking home in the street, and all of a sudden, it's, 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 all of a sudden, some white woman cross, cross the cross all the street and walks in front of me. And then at some particular point, she gets like, oh, you know, black guys in back of me, right, like that. And so, when I put these on and I walk with these, make music, it's my music, you know, then they won't, they know, you see, then they, they can't say that I snuck up on them or something like that. Okay, that's one reason, right? Another reason, more specific reason, actually the real 
the real reason is because look, you remember the the, the early the early well you know early seventies late sixties early very late sixties sixties sixty nine to be exact when they have black exploitation films so called black exploitation films you know well that's when we had when the black hero come on the screen then we had he had his theme music right. And you know who picked that off? You know, when I was in India, you know, you know, if you go to an Indian movie when the when the when the hero comes on the scene, they have the da da the big music, right? They got that from black exploitation movies. I don't care what they you yeah, see what I'm saying? So everything comes from black, yeah. Hey, black Americans, that's what we do. We create, we leave, people get pissed off, they the deep, the poof, the deep, they they steal, they or they, they alter whatever it is. And just we keep on going and keep on doing anyway, back to so, so this is my theme music, right? Okay, so that's one thing. One time I was in Cape Town, right? Because I was, uh, I, I, I do stuff, right? I work audio drama. And I, this guy who'd known me for years, I would come out, I was working at Adasa, working out of Adasa, I should say. That. No, I don't work for nobody. And so, find a guy who we would talk all the time. He says, oh, I understand. Audio drama. See? This is like... Audio drama. You hear this? This is audio drama. It's a whole long story. I'm giving you a long story for a reason, right? So every so every once in a while, I get a reason why I wear what I wear. And then, oh, hey, when I was in uh, when I was in Alice, I would wear them. And then some people thought I was like a Sangoma. They say people don't want to mess with me because it, something happened with this brother. We don't know. But he's got the sound. He's got the you look. He's he's he's, he's he's American, but he's here. And nobody else is here. But but he does. Oof, that, that. So they just nobody knows how to deal with me when I'm when I'm traveling. Okay, now internet. There's this guy. Oh gosh. Mohan M O H A N is um oh man what's his name oh man I should look I should have looked him up anyway he does this stuff on Ind Indian architecture right um, the temples and stuff like that oh I should say this I always no nah, I would say if if I think the one there's two things I think I would study right um uh, what do you call that uh, not not paleontology whatever whatever uh, um, anthropology one thing right. I think that's a good discipline. But the other thing is art history. Yeah, you can you can do war history, but art history is the best. As far as if you want an understanding of stuff like that. But this guy here, shout out to all my Pan African brothers, my my Pan Africanist brothers, right? Or they always get up with Egypt and they wonder to tea where we got to get all together. Blah, blah, blah. But this guy in India is very interesting because. He brings, he talks about all the, there's a lot of temples. There's a lot, I've been, there's a lot of temples. I've been all over India. Temples all over the place. You can, you can, you talk about God consciousness, man. You, you, you have Hindu consciousness or, you know, Buddhist con consciousness all over the place because they're there. You can't, you can't miss it, right? More, 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 more temples than you got churches, right? Little, big, whatever. But he shows you the architect. It's so intricate stuff like that. And when he made a connection between Indian architecture and Egyptian architecture. So all of my pan Africans, but let me just say this to you guys, right? Hey, I'm glad you done, did your study. Uh, a, a shout out to Anthony Brown, no, no shade, nothing like that, you know? Hey, even to my, even to my, even to my intimate, well, my, all the professors that deal with, with Indian, they, they go back to Egypt every time they did that, 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 that. But there is a connection between Egyptian architecture and Indian architecture, and this guy is bringing it out. So I would say, well, my Pan Africans, brother, if you could be Pan African all over, Pan all over the world, and Black people all over the world, you need to get to India and start making some connections because there's some real connections. I know I've advanced to make the connection to to to, to America's, you know, to, to, they came before Columbus and all the rest of that stuff. I understand all that stuff, but I'm trying to say, I, I mean, I shouldn't say this, but but the, the circles that I travel that I'm aware of. They don't. They do not deal with this at all. And this brother is dealing with this. And I say brother because he's he's he black. <laughs> I don't know if he's Tamil, but for Tamil, do hey, that's the other thing he was saying. This is uh, is a Shiva. One of the guys. It's interesting. This is why I bring this up. Shiva. Right, there's, you know, there's a couple the untouchables, whatever the, the the lower caste, whatever it is, right? But he was bringing up on, on one of these, one of his things, right? He was saying how, you know, she he wore where you know the bells on the on the on the ankles. This is what I do, sir. This this is like my my connection, I guess, to to India because I just put it on my oh, you can't see it, I'm snap it on my ankle like that, and then I walk. 
out. So you hear this beautiful sound. It's beautiful to me, right? Like that. But here's the thing. So he is saying Shiva, but Shiva also has a begging bowl. So was Shiva from the lower caste? He has these questions like that. But here's the thing. She was in all these temples or whatever happened. And then there's this, this certain thing they do. But the, the high class, the, the priest, whatever, that's the, that's the upper class of the this whole, you know, the caste system that they have in India right there. But they have to clean the, the Shiva. Interesting, don't you think? This is what the internet is supposed to be about. No, no, I'm sorry. The internet is all those things. The, the politicians people have you focus on certain things and then you you up there reacting to those things. You're acting to backwash. Find your own. There's so much stuff there. Leave that. Okay, you could okay, you can do your sports. You can do your uh, you know, whoever's talking about who, whatever now nah, I can there's beefing, everybody's beefing, everybody's trying to call everybody out. You can do all that stuff. But you should be looking for some knowledge. So what I'm trying to say is what what this has done for me. This gives me another reason why I wear my, I'm identifying with the, you see, I let you fill in the dots. That's what it's all to be about. That's what it's supposed to be about. Okay. So something else on the internet, some other time, let me just leave it because I talk, I'll call, I don't talk way too long. Sorry. Because this is the other thing, I'm, I make a, um, 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 I make a, how do you say, behind the scenes, whatever have you, and I put it, I put it on uh, my YouTube because um, my Instagram, well, basically my Instagram is also being archived on my YouTube channel. Can I use? I don't like I said for archive purposes only. But my bit shoot picks up the YouTube thing, so I'm archived three. But this, this, uh, what do you call it? Uh, uh, Instagram is archived three places, right? And then, of course, my YouTube is all type YouTube and also a bit shoot, right? And, also, and James, and, and they, these guys, they done left YouTube or whatever have you. And they're only on, I say that, they're on other platforms, but they're on, you can get uh, James Cobb Recovery Report, very good thing, on bit shoot. See? So, there's, so the internet is not just YouTube and whatever they, whatever your tiki taki or whatever the stuff, it's other things. So you should find your other things, you know, that way you can be you know, informed, right? Just to let you all that, I'll talk about something else. I, I, I still am not through with the internet. There's a whole other thing that people need, have, have to know. But like I said, know how to use it, right? And stop abusing it, please. Oh, boy. Check you all later. All right. Done, did he done, done, done. Ooh, I was way, way, way too long with that. But it was necessary for me. I should, oh, I should, I should look up that guy's, first of all, let me, let me, let me do this. Why? Um, so I call it the brother explains the internet. The brother explains ex please, uh, a uh, explains the internet. Inter internet. Okay, that's what we'll put capital E for explains. Explains the internet. Uh, I should tag that guy. Oh, what's his name? Oh, man, what's his name? Can I go on? Let me go out of here for a second. See if I can. No, but he's on. Oh, how should I do this? Oh, what's his name? What's his name? Mahone. Let me, let me see if I can find him. Tag. Yeah, tag. M O H A N O M O M O No results. Oh, wait a second. Uh, what's this? De oh man, I should look his name up. No, that's not what his name is. I wonder if I can come back to this if I go out. I don't know if I can do that. Um, de Depre, D, D, E, P, E, E, N, E, E, N, no results found. Oh, man, what should I put? Um, Indian temples, D, uh, okay. Indian temples, G, E, 
and P L E is Indian temples, not uh, ancient temples of India. Now, so I got I'm, 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 I'm being obsessed now, I'm trying to get this brother's name. Oh, man, I'm afraid to go away from the thing. Okay, I just I just have to leave it. Oh, I'll put it in the footnotes. Yeah, why not? Uh, I'll put it in the tag. Let's leave that alone. Air location, Western Branch. I'll put it in the footnotes. I'll look them up and put it in the, the comments. Uh, advancing. This was good about the internet too. You can, you know, you can do stuff. Western Branch, uh, advancing. Air to series. Uh, still morning, so let me put in the morning. In the morning. In the morning. When the moon is at its wrist, you'll find me at the time I loved best. Okay, yes, what's the name? Charlie Tunner. Okay, give him, I gave him a like. It's that bone conductive earplugs. I'm waiting for um, my 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 guys to make one. You see what? See if that comes. Oh, this Yaki. Hey, Yaki, I wrote you an instant. I wrote I wrote you an email to try to get an appointment. I'm coming your way in the beginning of December, man. Y'all better be available. Some not you, but somebody from your place. I'll just rock up, I guess. They ask my questions when I get there. Whether they got my thing or not. I'll leave that alone. What am I looking for? Oh, I'm looking for... Uh, I'm looking for this guy. He posts all the time. I'm sure I'll find him. I'm sure I will find him. Oh, man. I go to shorts. Oh, go to reels. Let me go to reels. I'm paying people of Ah. Come on now. Just when I'm trying to find something, that's when it's just not going to happen. Ugh. Come on, guy. He's here all the time. Now, I'm sure maybe I should go because I know I, uh, uh, I would have, I, uh, Got it on favorites or something like that? I must have it someplace. This is going to bug me out if I can't find this guy's name. Mail post story live guide fundraiser. Okay. Here's my lovely wife. No, this is not good. How can I find out where... Uh, let me just go to YouTube, and then YouTube will give me his shorts. He's got to be in shorts someplace. Oh, come on, man. Just when I'm looking for something, that's when they don't give it to me? I can't believe it. Oh. Come on. All the people are... Just when I want something, I can't find it. Hey guys, oh, here, he, he, here he is. Praveen Mohan. P R A V E E N M O H A N. Praveen Mohan. I got him here, Praveen. I'm subscribed to him. P R A V. What's my? P R A V E E N Mohan. P R A V E E N. Let me just put him in my. P-R-A-V-E-E-N and what I will do is I will go to the notes to my notes write me P-R-E-V A did I say A-A-N? No, 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 man. M-O-H-A-N Oh man, I better not do it that way. Cancel. Let me find him again. 
I mean, go to you. Let's, yeah. Uh, go to his page again. Come Baby. On. That's probably him. I'm sorry, I wasted a lot of time, but I got to do this. I'm still with a counter race codification. Nearly full of juniors hitting it. That's good. I'm glad all these folks are, are getting some uh, some notoriety because the people they have us looking after aren't the people we need to look. Come on now. I just had you. Okay, let me look at it this way. Where is it at? Why? No, I'm really lost. I can't find. How does. This is crazy. P R P R E E V V A N. Let me see, is this the guy? P R A. Yeah. This is him. So now I gotta basically take his stuff. Here he is. Okay. What I will do. We knew like this, but YouTube was racist. It hates Hinduism. It and does. it does not want YouTubers to make videos about Hindu temples. Really? This is because YouTube management genuinely thinks that Hindu temples are dirty, barbaric places. P-R-A-V-E-E-N. Not fit to be seen by normal people. -E -E I will prove this to you. Many of you know that two years ago, YouTube deleted some of my videos. It demonetized some videos and even threatened to ban my channel and I posted uh, videos about the ban but then YouTube realized it made a mistake and it stopped doing that but did it no it still demonetizes many of my videos it still puts so many different types of restrictions on my videos I have chosen to be quiet because I don't like drama all I want to do is research about ancient sites but what youtube is doing now is not just anti praveen mohan it's taking Pravi an anti-hindu position mm -hmm. for example my latest video i showed nearly 40 ancient carvings all of them over one i'm looking for here i'm really i'm sorry i've taken a lot of space here to not make my point. Thank you. Come on. Come on. How come I can't get what I'm looking for? Oh, uh, I don't think I'm just going to, I don't want to say give up, but I have to look at this another way. I'll do another way. I'll I spent enough time with you guys. Sorry, I'm just, I'm just sort of weirdly, I don't want to say frustrated, but I don't understand why I can't get what I want. So, hey, look, sorry, it took a long time, almost for almost an hour looking for, looking for what I'm looking for. And all I want to do is, is post it up on them. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Before I figure it out, we'll see what happens. All right? Talk to you later. Bye.